to in, uh... I was gonna say impromptu, but it's not. I planned this in advance. Welcome to a special Friday edition of the Mallory Lamb stream. That's not really what it's called. I just thought I'd say that. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, you can probably tell I'm not used to streaming in the middle of a Friday. Uh, it's a little different for me, but it's 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 so fine. It's so fine. <laughs> okay. Um, so let's not dilly-dally with anything, and let's just kind of go ahead and get into it then. Um, hello, hello! <laughs> As you can see, I've already, um, pulled up the game. It's already loaded and everything. I didn't want to potentially waste any time. You know. It is very low volume, though. Um, I'm gonna be finagling with the volume as we go. Um, this is my first time streaming my on a Switch at all. Um, and so there might still be some wonkiness with the connections and the setup and stuff, so please, please bear with me on that. Um, but I don't think it should be too egregious in any way. But yeah, we're playing Pokemon Violet! I'm so excited! <laughs> um... If you don't know, I am a lifelong diehard Pokemon fan. I have been a Pokemon fan since they brought it to America. <laughs> ah, Alola, Toxan. <laughs> um, so anytime there's a new Pokemon game, it, I usually... When I was in college, I would take the day off of school. Um, now as an adult, I take day job off and I just play Pokemon on the day it comes out every time. Um, even if the game isn't that good, I know I've been seeing... Um, either love or hatred for this game, and I already have a feeling I'm gonna be somewhere in the middle. But anyway, let's go ahead and <laughs> get started. Um, and as you can probably guess by my title, I already know what starter I'm going to pick. <laughs> um, so f for look, I'm just going to pick, I don't know, I like the blonde hair. And I, I know that I'm not going to stick with that look for long. You know, you know. So what is my name? My name is Mallory. M-A... Nope. <laughs> there we go. That's the name. Oh. Oh, they're letting you change it right off the bat then, huh? Standard shortcut side braid. <laughs> That's ca Oh! Good morning, Tuttle! <laughs> oh, wow. Um... I wish I had slept in that plate. I had the I had the chance to, and then I was like, no, nah, I'm gonna I'm gonna play Pokemon. <laughs> I felt like waiting as long as I did was enough. I like that. Why are your eyes though? I don't no. 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 I'm gonna look at everything. <laughs> Oof. Those are cute. No, not for me. Not for me. I'm gonna do the long bob. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like so concerned about it. Is there- <gasps> Hey! It kind of matches my hair. Of course they have violet and scarlet. <laughs> Ash purple? Ooh! They have so many colors now! Oh, this is fun. <laughs> Denim blue. Um, I like violet. I like ash purple. I think it's really pretty. Lavender is the most accurate, I would say. Smoky pink is okay. I think I did pink brown the entire time in um, Sword and Shield, but we'll go with. Th this doesn't matter. <laughs> but we'll yes. And then change look, I guess, is like your eyebrows and stuff. Oh, eye shapes. I like that they're letting you do this right off the bat. And that you don't have to unlock it later. I thought that was going to be the thing. Because, you know, that's how it was in Sword and Shield, right? Uh, I like this one. I have blue eyes. They also have Ultra Marine. Ooh, that looks a little bit more accurate. 
light blue. No, that's not me. Blue gray. No, that's a little too gray. Yellow with blue pupils. Oh. <laughs> I didn't. I'm sorry. Maybe I should have done this before I started. St Ooh, that's spooky. Gotta make sure your eyebrows are the same color. Yeah, I'll, I'm getting there. There's a lot. Do you see how many options there are? I'm like, what is this? A po <laughs> is this a Pokemon game? <laughs> oh, those are cute. Already know I'm gonna pick the heavy lashes of of any category. That's just no. That's a little too much mascara for me. I like that one too. I think I'll go with B. Oh, it is lagging a little bit. Yeah, I'd heard that there was some lag issues with this game, so I was kind of prepared coming into it. Ooh! You can pick any of the colors for the eyelashes. Oh, that's fun. I'm going to... I'm actually going to do the red. No, wait. The wine red. Yeah, I like that. Oh, it's really nice. You're telling me I can choose more than boy or girl in this game? Yeah, you're doing... I'm like, oh... This is so... This is so extra. I'm like, I'm here for it, don't get me wrong. I love character customization. I'm that person that spends like eight hours in the character customization screen. I like those. Okay. Just make them match and move on. Yay. Oh my god, they're different mouths. I like the- I like the cat face. I like the cat face. I don't know- I don't know if I'll go with it, but I like it. Honestly, there's not a ton of variation in the mouths. Yeah. Oh my god, there's lipstick colors. Finally, you can live out your dream of being like- a beauty guru, but in Pokemon. <laughs> Uwu face. Yeah, now that I have the lipstick on, I can see it a little bit better. No. Freckles! So some- a fun fact about me. Um, I actually have freckles. I, I forgot to put- Immersion break, I forgot to put them on my model. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Okay. I'm done. We're, we're backing out now. Yay! Yes, language of English, please. Because that's the one I can read. Oh, hang on. Let me... My volume settings are kind of blocking the way. There we go. That's better. <laughs> No, I have horns, IRL. I just forgot the freckles. Leading the way into the future while valuing our individuality. Why is it in all caps? Why are we having... I, I hope there's lots of all caps sections like in Yakuza. It's time for you two to dive into the world of Pokemon. I guess Makuhina and Hariyama are in this game, because I saw Hariyama. Yay, let's go. <laughs> That's a guy. That is indeed some man with a pen. They're very angry about it. They're just so excited they have to yell. Okay, there we go. Haldea is a sprawling region bursting with lush nature and magnificent landscapes. It is also, of course, home to the mysterious creatures known to us as Pokemon. They reside here in great numbers. In fact, his glasses look like they're made out of paper. <laughs> it's that thing. I can't remember the name of it. Palmy? No, that's not it. 
Pokemon can be found living all over. In the seas, in the skies, even in our cities and towns. Ooh, Garchomp! And Hoppip and Swablu. I, I have been very good about not spoiling myself, so learning what all the Pokemon are that are going to be in this one. I see Jigglypuff. I see uh, Rufflet. I already knew Ampharos was going to be in here. It's some evolution of it, at least. Yeah. We humans coexist with Pokemon as we both help one another to live and thrive. Uva Academy is here to help you learn even more about these precious partners. I don't need to go to Pokemon school. <laughs> Within our halls, people from all regions gather to study together. Muck, what is that? Tauros? Why is it bl Why is the- Hang on, y'all. Y'all, what is up with that Tauros? Is that a- Are we getting a variant on Tauros? Oh! Oh boy! Oh boy! <laughs> Sorry. Pokemon School is kind of goofy. Yeah, but it's... I could go on and on about these games. And as Pokemon trainers, they have their Pokemon do battle, growing alongside them regional-specific Tauros! At Spain, of course, there's a Tauros variant. Look, I didn't think about that. I'm just... Look, I'm excited. <laughs> While a robust curriculum, of course, work helps our students draw forth their fullest potential. I wonder what the shiny Tauros uh, is gonna look like. Miss Magius! Miss Magius! Miss Magius! Yes! Hello! Miss Trevis is one of my favorites. Very happy. Oh yeah, I got Violet, by the way. So we got the purple uh, cyber future dragon boy. Yay! They were team losing! <laughs> Oh boy. Oh boy. He's flying through the- Oh my god, look at all Tauros. They still have the three tails. That's cool. Of course Eevee's in this game. Flamingos! Flamingos! Yo, they're flamingos! What the fuck? Yo! Yo! I haven't seen that one yet. Oh man, I'm so <laughs> y'all. I'm excited. <laughs> oh, birds! I always expect new birds. Like new birds is a given, but birds. They have little pompadours. I wonder if they'll sing songs from Greece. <laughs> that was very stupid of me to say. Sorry. <laughs> They all have to have the accents, the like 50s greaser with a slight twinge of Jersey accent to it. That is a very empty room. Oh, the Applin sticker. I love Applin. Appleton is better than Flapple. Fight me on it. Yep, that's how you walk. Now what do you want me to do? Oh, it's, um... Oh my god, not Greedent. Squovit. <laughs> there are too many Pokemon for my brain to remember all the names just at the drop of a hat. Squirrel. This is a big-ass house! I wonder what your family does to afford this here. Look how big the kitchen is! That is a big ass kitchen! Good morning, Mallory. Oh, already in your uniform and everything. Well, it is your first day at your new school, after all. I hate school. <laughs> I'm so excited for you. I know we're playing as a child. Still, you might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door. The school contacted me and said that you're supposed to wait here a little longer. Their words, not mine. Okay. Apparently there's something very important for your first day that still hasn't arrived. Ding dong! Maybe that's the very thing we're waiting for. Mallory, get the door, would you? All I know is people think the mom is hot again. Oh, that's just boring. 
I don't even care. Just, no, wait, here's the door. Do forgive the intrusion. Look at the, he's got a little pointy at the back of his hair. It's like the, it's like the top of a chow's head. Yeah, when do they not think the mom is hot? That's boring. You are Miss Mallory, yes? On behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents. Look at the premiere ball clips. Ah, and also for my delay in introducing myself. I am the director of Uva Academy. You may call me Mr. Clavel. Oh, the facial hair. He's got a soul patch type of thing going on. The director? And you came in person to... Ba -ba 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 -ba. And you came in person to help my daughter with her first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire academy, including any failures on its part. So here at last are the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. It's just a bag. Documents are usually not carried in a shopping bag. Goodness, you really needn't have. Since you've come all this way, can I at least offer you a cup of tea? Uh, no need to trouble yourself. Mallory, I've got a thing or two to discuss with the director here. Why don't you head back up to your room and finish getting ready for school? You'll need your bag. And your hats as well. This is Pokemon. Everybody's gotta have a hat. Now, Mr. Clavel, you must simply join me for a cuppa. This way. Well, how can I refuse such a kind offer? A cuppa is the most British thing I've ever read. And I know that this is a region based on Spain, but, you know, I speak English. So, like, I'm sure they say it in Spain, too, but I would just never pick up on that, because I don't speak Spanish. It's a new Nintendo Switch system. This one's got a bigger screen. Oh, it's the same color Joy-Cons! Yeah, I have the Animal Crossing Switch. But it's got the same Joy-Cons as mine. It's your very own wardrobe, adorned with Pokemon stickers. Uh, bag and hat, right. That's what we need. Ready to put on your hat and grab your bag? Yes. Not much else for me to do. Also, was the head of the bed facing the wall? Uh-huh. I don't need to read any of that. Yeah, it is! That's a weird layout choice. So ACNH is canon in Pokemon? I could see it. Why not have your bed face, like, not the wall? I don't know. Yeah, it's a little laggy. It's fine. You know what? It's I'm not expecting the world of these games, and I never have. Well, maybe when I was like five, or <laughs> however old I was when I started playing them by myself. But, uh, I've learned to temper my expectations, especially on release days. Oh, just look at you, all ready for your big first day. Yes, the uniform of our storied academy suits you quite well indeed. Huh! Oh gracious, how very careless of me. I had entirely forgotten that I've something else for you, Miss Mallory. A most important thing. But your living room is hardly the place for it. Would you care to follow me outside? I wonder how he refrains from getting his pants dirty. I wonder what this important thing might be. Let's follow the director out and see, shall we? I love how I look nothing like my mom at all. It's kind of funny. I bet the mom is probably based on like you, the character you choose, or I could be wrong. Like, the hair color is probably based on the initial character you choose. But I just picked one that was like... I don't know. <laughs> Yay! Right then, dear Pokémon! Time to come out of your Pokéballs! Oh boy! Pumpkins! Yay, it's the Scarlet Violet starters. I already know who I want. We provide each student entering the academy a Pokemon of their own. I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Sprigatito, the grass cat Pokemon. Ah, it's so cute! 
Who's it, Coco? The fire croc Pokemon. Craw. And Quaxly, the duckling Pokemon. Uh huh. <laughs> They're all very good company. Why, they usually refuse to even leave my side. I know the skin tone of the mom is deaf based on you. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Oh, they all want to join! Hmm, so it turns out they're more interested in you, Miss Mallory, than familiar old me. I do wish I could stay and see which one you'll choose, but I must be off to my next home visit. I'll be at the house, just over there. Take your time with your decision, then come find me once your mind is made up. Now, if you'll excuse me, until next we meet. Huh? What a mannerly fellow that director of yours is. These three are all lovely, but you need to choose just one, right? Not an easy task. Why not take this opportunity to walk about with these little ones and get to know them? What? I wasn't expecting this. I'm sure they have lots to teach you. Oh, but before you go, I got you a little something to celebrate your big day. Take it with you if you're going out on your own. Yeah. Phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a brand new phone. According to the instructions, blah, blah, blah. No, off you go. Have fun. Hey, okay, bye. Oh, they're so cute. What is it? He's looking at something. What is he looking at? He's staring at something. They're all just kind of hanging out. Oh, look at the kitty! Yeah, I'm definitely still going for uh, Sprigatito, but um, I'm super interested to see what all three of them are going to evolve into. Because I have not seen yet. And I've got my fingers and toes crossed that Sprigatito will stay on four legs. And if you know, do not put it in the chat, please. Do not. I don't want it to be spoiled. Oh. What do you see, duck? Quaxley's cute. I mean, all three of them are cute. Um. As I do with every, <laughs> every new game. I sent the starters to Mama Sheep. I was like, which one's your favorite? Her favorite is Quaxley. Pobo Poco. He's having a fun time. Ooh! Okay. We're doing some speeds. Are you gonna follow me, little guys? Oh, you are! Oh, this is so precious! They're just running in the field having a fun time. <laughs> uh, I just hear the little clips in the audio and it just makes me laugh. Oh. Goodness. Their little footsteps are so cute sounding. Oh, where'd they go? Yep, there's one, there's two. That, it's a water type. No, it's so cute! I love it! He's gonna eat that orange. Oh! <laughs> he sneezed! Are you these three's trainer? No. Not quite. Miss Mallory has yet to make her choice, you see. Yeah, that's true. I... I do wonder which of them she will choose as her first Pokemon. Fua Coco still eating it? <laughs> Quaxley! <laughs> I'm Team Fua Coco. Nice! Every, I mean, eventually I will get all three. I also eat burned food. Buenas! We haven't met, have we? 
I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you here quite so soon. I, what was I supposed to do? You told me to just walk over here. Hang on, director. Is this who I think it is? What does that mean? Yes, this is our academy's newest student, Miss Mallory. She will be attending as of today. So you're that kid who moved in up the road. I've been dying to find out more about you. That's weird. I'm Nimona. Normally I live in the school dorms, but home is here. What do you say, new neighbor? Wanna be friends? That's... Sure, why not? That's not how real life works, but whatever. This was Pokemon. Love that enthusiasm. We're gonna get along just fine. Miss Nimona is president of our student council and a champion-ranked trainer in her own right. I absolutely love Pokemon battling. Ba, ba, ba. In fact, we should battle right now. You and me! Easy now. You two will be in the same class, so you'll have plenty of time to battle later. I somehow don't trust Nimona. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I get it. It's just how Pokemon makes rivals and stuff. I don't know how to explain it, but I get why you say that. I don't... Yeah. <laughs> and get to know one another better, of course. She's gonna steal your legs! <laughs> We're gonna be neighbors and classmates? Nice! We'll be able to battle all we want. Okay... On that note, Miss Mallory... Which Pokemon? Have you decided which of these Pokemon you would like to be your first partner? Yes, I decided that before I started playing the game! Pachico. Yay! Kitty! It's so fucking cute! Yay. Ah! It's so cute! I will name you Gatito. Oh, it's a little boy. Boy kitty. I think another reason this feels so laggy is because my uh, capture card setup lags just a touch. Gatito! That is your name. Hopefully, hopefully, we will stay on. Four legs. Oh, it's so precious! It's so cute! Oh, I think I might have to cave and get the life-size plushie for this one. Oh, it's so precious. <laughs> I love cats. Sprigatito seems to have taken quite a liking to you, Miss Mallory. It's so cute. This is your first Pokemon, yes? Please raise it with love and care. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked safely inside a Pokeball. Mallory, I can't believe you actually chose Sprigatito. I mean, like, way to make the perfect choice for you. You two make such a good combo. She is just straight out the gate, isn't she? She's a little weird. Can I choose one of these Pokemon too, Director Clavel? Oh, but... Did you not receive a Pokemon when you entered the Academy, Miss Nimona? Not back then, no. I had other Pokemon I was focused on raising at the time. But now I want to raise a new Pokemon alongside Mallory while she raises her own new partner. Indeed, a rather splendid idea. If you wish to raise one of these Pokemon on equal footing with Miss Mallory here, I shall be more than happy to allow it. Yes! Pick up pick. Yes! Since Mallory chose Sprigatito, I'll go for this little one. Nice to meet you, Quaxley. Welcome to the team. Cute! The duck is cute, too. I'm just... I'm not the biggest duck person, but... No, I... Out of all of the birds... Oh! Have a good rest of your day, and I will enjoy. Thank you, Toxin. <laughs> out of all the birds, ducks are up there, actually. But, like... If it's, if it's ducks or cats, I'm going cats. Now that we've chosen our Pokemon, we have to battle. I'll be waiting for you down at the beach. Come join me when you're ready. Bye. 
As you may have noticed, Miss Nimona is a tad overly fond of Pokemon battling. But I do hope you'll join her for a battle. It will help you get to know your own Pokemon as well. Thanks. Oof. Okay, and it's got a little map objective. Oh, and the map spins. Ooh, fancy. Okay, now I'm gonna take a second and just kind of look at. Oh, there's a shining like light tower up there. I wonder what that is. It's a pretty open environment. Lots of orange trees, which makes sense. Well, I guess let's just go ahead and battle then. There's not really anything else I can think of to do. Then to progress. She's taller than I am. Oof. Anyone can be a Pokemon trainer, as long as they have Pokemon by their side. And it's our duty as trainers to help our Pokemon grow stronger through battle. So, you ready to battle me, Mallory? Yeah. Perfecto! I'm so excited. For this battle, I think I'll use... Miss Nimona. Ducks are pretty good. Don't really care for Fuecoco and Quaxley, though. They're meh. Yeah, f out of all of them, I think Fuecoco is my least favorite. Um, I don't know. My I know my opinion will change when I see their final evolutions. I just, I know myself. So. Like, I, I thought Poplio was meh, and then I like used Poplio and then now Poplio is probably probably one of my favorite starters. Miss Nimona. I don't know if I already said that or not, but I'll say it again. I trust you remember that Miss Mallory is wholly inexperienced in Pokemon battling. <laughs> Whoops. Good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out my new buddy instead. Does the stand in the center and walk away it's three to ten paces. Come on, Mallory. Let us have a fruitful battle. Yeehaw. That is an interesting glove. Oh, oh, I see how it works now. Never mind. Ding! Duck! Kitty! I know this is your first Pokemon battle, so let's just have some fun. I'm going to speed run if it tells me to do anything. Meow! Battle music's pretty good. the music. I always just pick the starter I think looks the best. <laughs> That's totally valid. A, a lot of people do that. Um, I'm sure I've done that. Um, like for me, Gen 5 was like that. Out of the babies, I thought Oshawott looked the best, but then like at the end I was like, oh, Superior's really cool. Yeah, I won $300. Or Poke Dollars, whatever. Look at you, winning your first battle ever! You've got even more potential than I thought. This time I absolutely picked on which starter I thought looked the best as well, so <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> yeah, Ocelot! And then he got a, a revived in Legends Arceus and I thought that was cool. I like, I like the Legends Arceus uh, Samurott. I think he's really neat. You've got even more potential than I thought. You're gonna be a strong trainer for sure. <laughs> but now I want to try a different strategy. Let's go again. Just one more battle. <laughs> Miss Mallory and her Sprigatito are surely weary already from that last battle. Ah, sorry. I got kind of caught up in all the excitement. I'm really sorry, Mallory. Same your Sprigatito, too. Don't worry about it. Heh. <laughs> all right. Battle junkie. Yeah, that. Yeah. Yep. If she was a regular NPC, and she was like, ca you know, back when they have like types of care NPCs like youth and swimmer and lass, she would be battle junkie. 
You two seem to be becoming fast friends, though you've only just met. Can I count on you to take our Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate here under your wing, Miss Nimona? I'm sure she can learn a great deal from a champion ranked trainer such as yourself. Do they not have that anymore? I think they do. I'm just saying if she was just a random NPC, that would be her. You bet, sir. Oh, that reminds me. Since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you definitely need. Oh! Oh no, an app! An app! An app! She <laughs> I love Pokemon and it's silly ass graphics. <laughs> oh, it's just an app! The Pokedex is an app! It's not a separate machine anymore, it's just Technology be wildin! <laughs> I wish I still had my old Pokedex. Do you remember, like, back when it was, like, the first gen was the only gen in existence and they had, like, the toy Pokedexes? I had one! And I've lost it, and I'm so sad. I really wish I still had it. The Pokedex will automatically... Yeah, yeah, I... I... Mr. Jock? Back in my day... What about the entire generation where they had Pokedex ma machines? Which, I, I guess they were kind of like Walkmans? Or PDAs? PDAs. PDAs. Yet, no matter how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokémon never does. That is a truly timeless pleasure. I can relate. I get excited whenever I see a new Pokémon. As y'all saw when I saw the Flamingo ones in fucking free! <laughs> And the more Pokemon that you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. I hope you will both work hard toward the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. Look at my hair! My hair clips into my hat! It clips into my hat! That's so gr- I actually kind of love that. I'm, I'm hoping I can take the hat off at some point. As it should. All, all of that hair can't be contained under the hat. Although that's not- that is a reason why I don't hair wear hats. That's not the main reason. The main reason is the horns. <laughs> now, Miss Nimona, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. But I depend on you to see Miss Mallory to the academy. You would be doing me quite the favor. Of course! Leave it to me! Then I leave her in your capable hands. Alright, little one. It's time you and I were on our way. Bye, Fue Coco! you whenever I get you in Wonder Trade 20 to 30 hours in the future. Maybe I ought to make a little more time to work on my Pokedex along with all my battling. Oh! Right! Speaking of Pokedexes, Mallory, you've never- blah, blah, blah. you probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the Academy. Come with me! Okie doke. I'm not reading any of the menus, like tips and advice. Uh, th these games are not difficult. I will figure out what all the buttons do in a short amount of time. I have full confidence in myself. This is her house. This is her parents' house. How rich do you people have to be? What do your parents do for jobs? You've got like the entire gated, you've got the crazy ass landscaping, you got a fucking fountain? B is crouch. And there was also a slide, but I'm back in cutscene mode. Oh, Mallory. I hear that Demona here will- Demona? Demona here will be taking you to school. That's right, ma'am. Leave it to me. So you've already managed to make a friend. E. And I read about all the wonderful teachers you'll have looking after you at the school. Pokemon trainers are the broke as hell or the richest people on earth, and there's no in-between! None. Plus so ha many handy facilities you can use as much as you'd like. Add in your new friend, Nimona, and it sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. I... guess? No, you'll be staying in the school dorms. So I want you to promise me you'll eat proper meals. Here's a bit of spending money to start off with. I also packed the lunch for your first day. Is it a boarding school? Is 
It's a key item! It's a key item! Why is it a key item? Oh, and maybe you better take these two oh, potions. Didn't I get a... I think I got a, like a mystery gift ID for some random supplies. I'll have to do that at some point. I know every day in your new life is going to be full of exciting experiences far from home. Just try to savor them all. The good times and the hard times too. But if you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready for you. We need this sandwich to open the secret dungeon beneath the skull. You could be telling me the truth and I... Yeah, that sounds like something Pokemon could do. Oh, alright then. You two had better be off, I suppose. Take care on the way to school. Bye. Your mother's so nice. Oh, but I was going to teach you how to catch wild Pokemon. Come on, vamos! The little bit of Spanish they have used so far, I know what it means. It's like Gatito is little cat. Go. Okay, it was loading. All of the palm trees. She went that way. But my home is up that way, and there are just random people kind of standing around. And there's nothing else up this way but my house, so where do these people come from and why are they just kind of standing? The house looks bigger on the inside than the outside. Does it not? Oof. Okay, um, now I'll go where you want me to go, game. If it is true, I think I would die. I think it has to do with, like, um, what they've replaced the curry minigame with. Which was one of my favorite little bits of Sword and Shield, so I'm excited to make sandwiches. There's another light poking out. I wonder if those are items. Alright, this here is Poco Path. Ahem. Lechuk. What are those? What are those white ones? Out here, things are different than in town. You're gonna see wild Pokemon out and about. They'll be on the path and in the grass and such. I know how to play Pokemon. Get too close to one and you'll have to battle. But you've got Sprigatito for that, right? And if you want to try to catch a Pokemon, you've got to use a good old Pokeball. Are those spiders? I don't know. I've got tons. Have a few. I'm trying to speed so I can try and catch one, but it's going to make me catch the pig first, which is fine. When I see pigs, I think of mama sheep. <laughs> Not because she used to collect piggy banks when I was little. Press X. Okay. Well, I'm going to attack it first. I know how to I know how to catch my Pokemon. Yeah, Lashon is uh, a type of port as well. Lechon, I think is how it's pronounced. I know a tiny bit of Spanish because, you know, I grew up in the Southeast Free Country USA and there's lots of like Spanish stuff. Most things I say are weird when they're out of context. Let's catch the pig. Yay! Ha 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 ha! Good job, Gatito! Did that bar go up? Let's look! This Pokemon spurns all but the finest of foods. Its body gives off an herb like scent that pug Pokemon detest. I will not give you a nickname. It's a little truffle sniffing pig! cartridges that was so cute hello that was awesome you caught the very first pokemon you went for i'm crummy when it comes to actually catching pokemon maybe you should give me tips living bug repellent that's why has it taken them this long for that for a pokemon that's like a living bug repellent <laughs> sorry that just seems like a smart idea <laughs> That they should have done. Anyway, have some more Pokeballs, just in case. Not every catch works out. 
Yes, I'm very aware of that. Weaken the Pokemon, then throw the Pokeball. Remember that, and you'll be fine. Now go battle those wild Pokemon and catch some of them. Back up at the lighthouse. Okay, I want to go see what that spider thingy was. And what that light is coming off of the ground. It is an item! Okay. Makes sense, makes sense. So those lights are items, and I want to catch one of these guys. What is it? What is it? What is it? It's a spider! Oh my god, look at it! Tarantula? That's a name that's hard. Tarantula. That's a name. Oh my god! I think Nimona forgets that she can't KO a Pokemon if she wants to catch it. That sounds... Sounds like her from the little bits we've gleaned. <laughs> that, it, that sounds like right up her, <laughs> her alley. Okay, and you can just press X. I like that. Yay! We caught another Pokemon. Yay! Good job, Sprigatito. The thread it secretes from its rear is as strong as wire. The secret behind the thread's strength is a topic of ongoing research. It's a spider! And as you... So with nicknames, I'm I'm just... Sometimes I nickname them, sometimes I don't. It's it's really just kind of dependent on the Pokemon and the catch that happened and all of that shenanigans. But they are kind of all over the place, aren't they? There's not really paths and grass anymore. Pop it, 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 pop it! Come here! I am going to catch one of you. I haven't had a hop it. The hop it is so big! I forgot how big hop it is! Look at how big it is compared to Sprigatito! She's a big girl. Yeah. Yay! I like. Does the camera zoom in with every click now? That's fun. Yay, Gatito! I'm having fun. Outside of cold regions, hop up can be found practically everywhere. This is because the wind carries the species all over the world. I will name her Cotton. Because, you know, jump bluff. Oh, I have room for cotton ball, actually. I didn't think I would have room for the whole thing. Yay, cotton ball! Yee! Hop it, leaf. Oh, it's, um, 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 oh, bug. What is its name? What is its name? Scatterbug. Damn it, I couldn't remember. I was trying to remember before it told me. The, so the gen I'm least familiar with is X and Y. Because that's the one I've played the least. I, I think I got through like four gems and then I just wasn't able to pick it back up. So X and Y Pokemon are the one I have the hardest. Hoppip was big and this boy is small. This is a very tiny little, teeny tiny Scatterbug. Huh. Which sc Scatterbug evolves into Vivillian? That makes sense. Vivillian should probably be in every Pokemon game. With how they've like kind of written Vivillian into Pokemon canon. I loved how they did it in Pokemon Snap. I thought Pavilion and Pokemon Snap was fantastic. Yay! Lechonk leveled up. This Pokemon scatters poisonous powder to repel enemies. It will eat different plants depending on where it lives. No, you're not getting a name. Little toothy bug. Scatterbug house. Oh! Fletchling! Uh, yeah, I'm gonna scratch. 
Fletchling is very small. Fletchling is one of my favorite bird Pokemon. Nice! Um, Fletchling's really cute. Um, and I think Talonflame is a fun, uh, just fireflying type. Fletchling can be found in both rural and urban areas, but Fletchling is super cute. They once had a huge t territorial dispute with Squawkabilly! That's what that bird is called! Fights broke out all over town. Squawkabilly. It's rockabilly, because the hairstyle! That's... I can't wait to get that one. Oh boy. Very excited. Um, so I think now is a good time. I'm just going to take um, a couple... Neat. I'm going to take up a couple minutes to take a break. Um, I'm also going to try and run an ad during this break. I'll only be on for a couple minutes, three to four. Fletchling feels a lot more like a starter than a normal Pokemon. Yeah, it's because he's got the fire typing, and he's not, like, generic flying type like all the other early bird mons. Um, but I am going to, yeah, just take a, take a three to five minute break. Um, stretch, get some water and stuff. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Okay, I was sorry. I wanted to get the BRB music going, um, but yeah, I will be right back, and I will be running an ad break during this. Um, and I appreciate your consideration for that, <laughs> or whatever. I'll be right back.
sorry, that took longer than I thought it was going to. Um, turn this down. Okay, and then this back up. Yeehaw! Oh, that was an that was an accident. I full screened my capture window. Okay, what is it? Auto heal is negative. Minus negative. What the fuck? Ooh. Well, I didn't want to heal Fletchling, but oh, and you just press one button to make them the lead. That's fun. Oh god, they are all just crowded around me, aren't they? Ooh, you, you, you. Get, get, get. It is called Palmy. I did remember correctly. Check that shit out. It's so small. I keep saying that. I've got to have. I've got to have other commentary. Then it's so small or it's so big. I was just surprised by how big Hop It was, and I think it just started a train. <laughs> Yay! I've already caught so many Pokemans. And I see a light over there. I see two lights over there. And there's one right there, too. The pads of its paws are electricity discharging organs. Palmy fires electricity from its four pulse while standing unsteadily on its hind legs. I don't like it. I know how Pokemon boxes work. Oh, it looks like it might have two evolutions instead of one. I thought it would just be one, but I could be wrong. An electric mouse Pokemon. Hmm, where have I heard that before? Oh, a revive. I don't get their obsession with making more electric rodents, small mammals. I, I, I kind of just don't get it. Excuse me, Hopip. Good battle for experience. Um, If I did, sure. Oh wait, we would want to press just Y. We'll fight a Hopip with the Fletchling. We'll, we'll see how we do. Come on, Fletchling. Flying is super effective against grass. You can do this. You are literally the Pokemon to devastate flying types. You have... Wait, no. Wait, no. You are the, the Pokemon to devastate grass types. That's what I meant to say. You have fire and flying. Yay, Fletchling! <laughs> I'm gonna have to tell Bubsy there's a new spider Pokemon. Fun fact about Bubsy, who is my moderator and also, uh, he, uh, is the raccoon that lives behind my, <laughs> behind my house. He likes spiders a lot. He's a big spider fan. Even though he's a raccoon. I don't get it. But, um, he's gonna be very excited when he finds out that there's a new, uh, not only a new spider Pokemon, but it looks like an orb weaver, which are his favorite type of spiders. He'll... Me. Woof. Bye, LeChonk. Oh, not very effective. Oh, right. This isn't the right type of Pokemon to fight an electric mouse. Tatito. Meow. I'm so scared. I'm so scared of what its evolution is gonna look like. <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> Damn. But I got you to flinch. Haha. -ha. That hop up just phased out of existence. That was amazing. Good job, kitty!
Yay. Also, some people, I just, were, like, so offended about, like, the newer games having <clears throat> experience share on. Excuse me. Like, um, that's probably not gonna work for. Really, it's you. It just makes it easier, and I get people want to play it, like, difficultly. Hop it got sent to the back rooms. Oh no! But yeah, I, I get it. But I am I am a person who just wants to have a fun time and isn't super concerned about I don't want to make the game grindier for myself if I don't have to. And I understand why people do it. But that's just not me. Are we fighting two scatterbugs at once? Because the other one's just kinda hanging out over there. Maybe he's just watching. Good job, bird! He's yelling at us. Do you want to fight? You want to fight, little buggy? I think he does. Boink! It makes it hard to do certain play styles. Yeah, it should be an optional thing. I don't know. I also think... This is just me speculating. I obviously don't know anything about anything. But it feels like TPC sees the people who play that kind of game and see how a lot of times they just tend to stick to the older games, like uh, 3DS and stuff, or maybe just up to DS, and they're like, well, the, that's, it doesn't really feel like these people are going to come back and play new Pokemon games because they just want to, like, they want to do the OG uh, objective and do it, like, make it as tough as possible for them, but that's just not the direction the games are going, you know? Chesto Berry. Nice. Berries- okay, berries don't have the pillar of light. They just kind of sparkle in the ground. Okie doke, that's fine. Yes, I am. Oh! Am I gonna catch- am I gonna catch Miraidon? Is that what that is? I've never even heard that kind of cry before. Could be some strong Pokemon or something. I say we find whatever made that cry. Let's take a look around. Just be careful. There's a kind of unsafe cave not far from here, so steer clear. And I know your Rotom Phone can help keep you safe, but watch your step by these cliffs anyway. Okay, I'm gonna go get the items that are on the ground, and then I will go find the source. Because shiny things on the ground are far more distracting than a weird sound. <laughs> At least for me. That means there was an item on top of that house. Uh, I think it was our house? I'm curious what that is. Oh, those are just flowers. Hello. So we need to go this some away. Didn't it crash into the water at the opening? Yeah, there it is again. Yeah, didn't it crash into the beach? Hmm. Yeah, there it is! There it is! Oh, Hound Hours! Hound Hour! Ah! I love Hound Hour. I haven't seen you in so long! The ringing noise in the background music spooks me every time I say as the background music completely disappears. <laughs> oh! Did the ba, 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 ba. The phone! The phone! The phone! Did you see that? Is there a Rotom living in there? I know it's a Rotom phone, but is there like genuinely- The whole Rotom thing is weird to me. That's honestly one of the weirder things that they've stuck to in Pokemon. Having Rotom beard like device. Aw, oh, poor Miraidon. Are you okay? Rotom phone glide function? That's what happened! The mysterious Pokemon seems to be too weak to move. Maybe you can give it something to help it perk up? 
That's why it's a key item! You give your sandwich to it! That's why! That's so funny. I love it. I, I, it's, it doesn't even look like it can eat, you know? It looks like it's a robot. Meat Idon just looks like a robot. The eyes just do not help. Look, we're both purple! Yummy glass and metal. And LEDs. the right one I think I like him Kodaidon is fun do not get me wrong but I I, I love this guy <laughs> are we gonna time travel It's got the little electric sparkities. Oh, and his eyes change color. Neat. <laughs> he floats. fun are we gonna follow it i don't think any i don't know what else to do it's looking at us like come on bitch let's go okay mr dragon i you know I fuck, I fuck with them making a change to the legendaries and how they how influential they are to the story. Putting him right at the beginning, that's different. They I don't know if they've ever done that before. Oh, there she is. Way up there. There you are, Mallory. You're okay? You're not hurt, right? I'm fine. Thank goodness. I was really worried. If you'd gotten hurt because I said we should go looking for whatever made that cry. No, never mind that. Right now we've got to focus on getting you back up here. You've just got to find some way to climb out of there. If you can get close enough, I'll try pulling you up with one of my Pokemon's moves. Okay. Hey, what is that Pokemon in front of you? It looks super strong. Kind of seems like it's waiting for you. Thanks, Bucko. Oh, it's the Hound Hour. Whoa, that was amazing! That Pokemon might be as strong as mine. Maybe stronger. Is that a Houndoom? Oh, it's... Young Goose! Young Goose is the pre-evolution. Accidentally became... Yeah. Accidentally became friends with a legendary Pokemon by giving it a sandwich. Well, that's the kind of stuff you want to get from Pokemon, you know? Like... That is, like... Just a fun and charming thing. Accidentally making friends with a legendary because you give it a, you give it a sandwich. That, I love that. That's goofy. That that's fun. That's a good choice the Pokemon made. <laughs> also, sorry for the pauses. I got a bottle of chalky milk. Over break, so. It spends its waking hours searching endlessly for food. When the young goose is hungry, its ferocity gains a certain edge. Oh, you're going to go in the box, and I am never going to look at you again. I already have a feeling. Young Goose is not my favorite. Nor has it ever been a favorite. Have I caught a Houndour, though? Yeah, I just missed my chance to catch a Houndour. Houndoom's up there, so... Deeg! 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 <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> I always do that voice when I see Diglett because of the original anime. Every time. <laughs> what? 
Hatchling is really carrying some weight. I'm here for it, though. Let's catch the Diglett! Ding! Probably good to... No, no, grass is super effective against rock. Never mind. Gatito would also be good to have in the lead. Yay, Cotton Ball! So they have normal Diglets too? Yeah, I was wondering that! Its skin is very thin. If it is exposed to light, its blood heats up, causing it to grow weak. I didn't know that. Hmm. Eeg. Um, Diglet. Hey, there's- there are little items you get every time you catch a Pokemon. I can't switch- I can't switch Gatito to be the lead. This Fleshling's gonna have to continue to carry. That's fine. I have zero issues with that. I wanted that item! Oh no! Oh my god! Look at the ball! I want one! I want a hound hour. I want a girl hound hour. I want to name her Sheila. I don't know why. I don't know why. Hey, heads up some pretty rough and rowdy hound hour. Live in this cave. I'm glad you got your bodyguard, but watch your back. They're strong. Yeah, and I don't have a water type with me. Or. Or fairy, I guess. Fairy is super start. It's gonna be fun trying to remember my type, my internal type chart. Um. When I'm actively playing Pokemon, I've got all of the type combos recognized, like strengths and weaknesses and stuff. But it's been a minute. I wonder what that move was. Man, I want to see it up close. This is a fun guy. That's not a- that's not an Amoongus. Something's coming! Is it a Hound Hour? Is it Hound Doom? Hound Doom! Hello, Hound Doom. Puppy. I can have a cat and a dog in this game! Oh fuck. How- what level is it? LEVEL FOUR! <laughs> yeah? Oh, poor Fletchling's gonna die. What? What is happening? What is happening? Get him, Fletchling! Let's go! Miraidon's just like, oh, Jesus Christ. Team Magma, what are you doing here? It's not Team Magma, there's not enough Torkoal. Gen 3 is my favorite gen. <laughs> Can you tell? Gen 3 is the most nos- Gen 2 was the first one I played by myself, but Gen 3 is the most nostalgic for me. She gave me Subway and I would die for her. No, it's gotta be better than Subway. Maybe Jimmy John's? Maybe, oh, what is the other place? Firehouse Subs? There's a lot of better sub sandwich places than Subway. I haven't been to a Subway in like four years. <laughs> Way to go! For a second I thought you were both goners! Well, that's where I get Hound Hour. Bye, Miraidon! Oh. Whoa! What's wrong? Did the sandwich wear off? Maybe it was a Subway sandwich if it only lasted that long. Maybe it used up all its power? What is this Pokemon anyway? It kind of looks like a Cyclozar, but I've never seen one quite like this before. And now it looks so different from a minute ago. You think it's okay? I don't know. You can't tell either, huh, Mallory? 
Well, all that aside, I'm seriously glad to have you back up here in one piece. Needs another sandwich battery? <laughs> I like that. You know, that battle down there was really something. You and this fellow looked perfectly in sync facing down that Houndoom. Nah. What? You didn't even tell him what to do? No, it, it acted of its own accord. I guess it's not like you're this Pokemon's trainer yet, huh? Oh, he's up. Oh, good. Looks like it perked up a little. You think this fellow was the one making that mysterious cry we heard before? I would bet money on it. Oh man, oh man, oh man! The more I look at this Pokemon, the more mysterious it seems. I don't know. <laughs> if you do become its trainer, you gotta let me battle against it. Okay. Let's exchange numbers so we can get a touch if we're somehow separated again. She has a black phone case. And here, this will let you teach your Pokemon a move to help it battle stronger opponents. Oh, Swift. That's a valid starter TM. Seek before you use it, though. TMs can only be used once. Oh, we're back. Okay. Okay, we're back to TMs only being once. Because what? In Sword and Shield, TMs were unlimited use, and TRs were the one use, I think. Because they did- they got rid of HMs. You've both been through enough for a minute. I think we better take a breather. Let's just get to the lighthouse. That'll be a good spot to relax. Sure. Are you coming with us, Meat Idon? I'm going where it told me to go. Please follow. Oh. You're just gonna stand there? Okay. Okay, I'll go by myself. Goodbye. Oh, it's one of the dudes! Oh, I bet he sells stuff to make food with. Maybe. Why that little... What are you doing out here? Huh? It says you can make TMs. Maybe that's why- Oh, right! You can make TMs in this game! I'm not talking to you two. You can shove off. Wait, I know you. Aren't you Arvin? You're enrolled in the humanities track, right? And aren't you the son of that Pokemon researcher, Professor Turo? Doesn't matter who my dad is. He angry. The real issue here is what in the world this Pokemon is doing out here? And what is with this form it's in? See, we heard the strange cry and we tried to investigate, but Mallory fell off a cliff. That Pokemon saved her, but it seems like it wore itself out in the process. It got kind of... slumpy... afterward. But you should have seen it before! It looked totally different! It was unbelievably strong! Well, yeah, as it should be. But it can't fight while it's like this. The form Miraidon takes in battle, that's its true form. Miraidon? Is that this Pokemon's name? How do you know it? You can't go in the lab. It's locked. I don't remember ever seeing you around. But you're in the uniform. He's so angry! You go to the academy too, do you? Miraidon isn't the sort of Pokemon that any old trainer can hope to command. It's special. Special? How? What sort of Pokemon is it? You think you're up to ordering Miraidon around? And how about I test your worthiness? Sure, what the fuck ever. <laughs> well, look at you, quite the little go-getter. I've been feeling all out of sorts, so I'm gonna use this battle to blast these doldrums away! What planet are you from? The past? That's not a planet. Squobit. Fucking squirrel. Yay, bird. Sorry, I didn't read the line because I was drinking something. Sorry! <laughs> oh boy. Oh! Okay! One of my monitors just, like, stopped working for two seconds and then it came back and I was like, Holy shit, what the fuck is going on? I plan 
plan on, um, uh, in case you're wondering, I'm planning on playing probably until around 3 p.m. my time, so the three hour mark, because I have, I have stuff to do after this. Um, I took the day off to play Pokemon, but then it was like, oh, I've actually got stuff to do this evening. <laughs> it happens. All you had was a squall vent? That was so painful. Of course I know a thing or two about battle. I just whooped you. Loser? Wow, Mallory. That was awesome. I guess I wasn't ever going to stand a chance using some Pokemon I'd only just caught. Well, I just caught mine. But if you really think you can take Mutidon off my hands for me, you'll need this. It's the Pokeball that Brute's been kept in. Okay. So why do you have it? Anyway, that thing's your problem now. Not mine. Good luck. What the fuck? Fine, be that way, but you better actually show up for school. What a weirdo. Hi, Mute Idon. Yay. I wonder what level he is. That Arvin guy definitely knows more than he's letting on. Next time he and I are battling, I'm gonna wring some answers out of him. But, oh, right, we gotta climb the lighthouse. Can't wait to show you the view of our school. Okay. The only thing you needed was a sandwich, and you would have a legendary Pokemon. What a dummy. He- He's acting like it's a problem Pokemon. I don't quite get why. Is that the school? That's a fucking castle. There's a Pokemon Center. I like how the- So yeah, you walk all of those paths, so it's like a town all the way up to the- Okay, and then I see a different Pokemon Center, and I think that's kind of- yeah, that's uh, Nimona's house, I think. So your house is behind that tree. I think that's the cave I just fell into, maybe? Or... Hmm. And then there's stuff that way. Wingles! Goodbye! Look, Mallory, that's Mesa Goza. That's a big fucking school. What is that gate to the left? I wonder. And that huge building with a Pokeball on it is our school. That is a castle! It's gonna be so great having you in the same class. Do we have to do schoolwork in this game? I hope to god not. Isn't it awesome what you can see from up here? Mountains, forests, grasslands, beautiful nature stuff as far as the eye can see. That sure do be nature. And you know what's waiting for you all over these natural spaces? Tons of Pokemon! Consider this me officially telling you, welcome to Paldea! But anyway, like you can see, it's kind of a hike to get to school from here. Let's make it to Los Platos for starters. That's right on the way! Vamos! Come on! It's like we're playing Dora the Explorer. Vamanos! Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. More scatter bugs. I don't- I'm just kind of looking in the grass to see what's around- Hey, let's battle! Oh boy. Oh, Miraidon's just like in his own little section. Weird. Alright, little man. You're so tiny! If you talk to a Pokemon trainer like me, it means we're gonna battle! This little tiny suspender.
The spider's cute. Okay, the spider is growing on me. <sighs> Didn't expect that. Some child out of nowhere. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> bah humbug bug types. Did he just spit on his Pokeball? <clears throat> Excuse me. Yay! We win! <laughs> Your Pokemon are strong, huh? Why do you have $220, small child? Excuse me, excuse me, I see a shiny thing and I'm going to grab it. Ooh, X-Defense! I don't ever use that, so I always end up just... Psyduck! 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 This beak's a little bit of a different color than I remember. I think that's just my brain. Oh, that baseline is funky. I'm here for it. Oh, yeah. 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 Yay, duck duck. See, we didn't need Quaxley. We got our own duck. If its chronic headache peaks of may exhibit odd powers, it seems unable to recall such an episode. Oh, sorry, duck, I relate. I've been, been dealing with a lot of headaches lately. What's in between Golduck and Diglett, I wonder? Hmm. Duck. Duck. <gasps> Azuril! Azuril, Azuril, Azuril! <laughs> I want you! You're so tiny! I remember I had a Meryl lunchbox. And this was right after the um, first Pokemon movie came out. I was, in, I was very tiny. Um, and everybody would be like, that's not- it, it was Meryl, and so, you know, Meryl's Gen 2, but it showed up in the Pokemon film, and I was, like, one of the only kids in, like, kindergarten that had seen the Pokemon film, and they were like, that's not a real Pokemon, and I'm like, but it is! Go watch the movie! It's in the movie! <laughs> Which really, it was- it was in Pika- Oh! It's the- it's the one with the coin! It's the Pokemon with the coin! It's the new Pokemon with the higher up Grimgore or something? Let me go catch it. Its tail is packed full of the nutrients it needs to grow. It's a little crybaby. It's so precious and tiny and cute. I love it. Alright, alright, alright. Come here, bug. Get. No! I wanna. Oh, let me crouch. Let's see if that works. Can I crouch under here? Perfect. No. No! I can't! Oh. Okay. I... Alright. I guess he dropped his coin? But I wanted to catch him. Hmm. I guess I'll have to keep looking for one. Buizo! Hello! And all the Pokemon. This is awesome. There are three behind me. Yay! It inflates its flotation sack, keeping its face above water in order to watch for a prey movement. Yay, Boizel! I got Endure! Nice. Pokeball. 
And another Pokeball. I wonder how easy it is to shiny hunt in this game. I already know I want a shiny Mary. Eagly! Eagly buff! Eagly! Yes! I'm sorry, I'm getting so excited seeing all these Pokemon. Ah! <laughs> Eagly buff! I am going to catch you! Oh, I don't roll! And I want that Fido too, but I, I saw the Iggly buff and was just way more excited for the Iggly buff. I want rest in peace Fido in the background. Yeah, he ran away. <laughs> Who? Petito? Uh, we'll reply. We'll reply Tail Whip. We'll replace Tail Whip is what I'm trying to say. Yeah. <laughs> Cotton Ball should learn Fairy Wind. It probably knows like growl or splash. Okay, I I'm glad I'm learning all this stuff, but I want the Ralts, please. It likes to sing, but it is not yet good at it. With praise and encouragement, it will get better little by little. Yay, Igglybuff! I'm gonna add Igglybuff to my party. Um, I'll send Scatterbug. I'm. I think I'm going to focus on evolving the new ones first. But it is an Iggly buff. Yo! Are you a boy or a girl, Ralts? Mm. Oh, girl, Ralts! Hello, future Gardevoir. Oh, uh, the wild Pokemon battle music is... I'm very much vibing with it. I'm a fan. Yeah, Gardevoir! I, I mean, I'm gonna want to get a Gallade too, but you know. The girl routes evolve into Gardevoir and stuff. It's highly attuned to the emotions of people and Pokemon. It hides if it senses hostility. Of course, if I ever get a- yeah, catching Pokemon has been really easy. I'm sure that there might be, like, uh, an uptick in difficulty at some point, but I'm glad that it's easy right now. Fido! No. Oh, right, it's a fairy type. Suspenseful, but I don't mind that. Yay! Fido fur. The yeast in Fido's breath is useful for cooking, so this Pokemon has been protected by people since long ago. No, no nickname, but I will add to my party. We can run with six fairy types, we can make it work. Um, but I will switch out Cotton Ball. Oh, I wonder if it has two evolutions. I'm having so much fun catching all these Pokemans. I wonder how you get the Magikarp, though. This oh, oh, you managed to scramble back out of the water. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> I'll get him. I'll get a Magikarp later. Breathe in my wheat dog. Another Scatterbug. Man, they're just right on the edge of town, aren't they? Finally, we made it to a Pokemon Center. They den. Ice Q. I'm looking at the Pokemon on the advertisements. That is a Pokemon Center. The machine blinks! League points? Huh. Oh! Oh, the Pokemon 
materials are what are made to what you use to make TMs. Okay. Just gives me your league points. 5,000 league points. Holy shamoly. Lots of Pokemon materials. They did that robot dirty by making it look like a trash can. <laughs> and at the Union Circle, you can connect with other trainers to play co op. Okay. Mnemonics help out. Oh! Oh! Okay! Oh! Alright, alright. I'm just- I'm blazing through all this text. Okay. Oh, they've got pictures! They have pictures! Okay. I'm just- I'm just kind of looking to see, like, how it works. Ice Fang, Thunder Fang, Fire Fang. We can craft Disarming Voice and Low Kick. Cool, cool. Endure, I've already got. Okay. That's cool. I'll have to refer to that later. I. Oh, 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 oh! It's a bad sweet! Ah, yes! Yes! Yes, it's a bound sweet! Oh my god, Serena's in the game! Ah! <laughs> I'm so sorry <laughs> for your ears, but I love Serena. I'm so happy. This is Los Platos. We're always happy to serve up a helping of hospitality to anyone passing by. Time to talk to randos. What was that guy at the Pokemon Mart standing at that table for? What are you doing? Meetup spot. I saw a deerling. Ice cream. Oh. Oh. Uh, I don't know what any of that stuff means. It's nine hundred ish. Sure, I'll- I'll buy an ice cream. It kind of makes me want ice cream. <laughs> uh, ice cream is good. <laughs> that was kind of goofy. I hate this. <laughs> I guess it increases your catching power for certain types. Gatito, go! Feel free to run around. Little kitty. Oh, I see an item over there. Oh, I guess because I got too far away, it just auto recall. Well, I want to see the Tauros! I want to see the Tauros! Up close! His, look at his horns! It's really got that... Um... Thinking of... Uh, lo it, lo it's kind of like longhorn... Steer horns, isn't it? Really sticking like straight out to the sides. That's what it reminds me of. Um... I'm assuming we need to go to school now? I'm just looking around the town. There's Gearling and Bound Sweet. Cute. You're telling me you can't just leave your Pokemon to die on the other side of the map? I guess not. That guy's just sitting. What are you up to, sitting man? 
Oh. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> okay. I guess I'll just keep going. Just off to school now, dear? Careful on the road and remember to jot things down so you won't forget what you've accomplished. I think that means save the game. Yeah, I'll save. Yay! <laughs> I don't know why I've been saying yay like that recently. The handy rotom phone. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Uh-huh. I see Pichu and Happiny are potentially on the road ahead. That's exciting. Maybe I should go buy more Pokeballs, actually. I wish I had a bike. I wish I had a bike. I wish... Pelipar! Man, you want to know who's a good Pokemon in Pokemon Snap? Pelipper. Pelipper was so fun. So much goofy shit. Two. Oh. Two, three, four, five, six... Worth it. I will talk to you, tiny child. Yes, I have. I played Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. <laughs> I think I only played the first of uh, ones, though. Ugh. Which one was which? Blue is on the DS and red was on the Game Boy? I played the DS version. I think I'm right. Maybe. That's a trainer battle. And eh, why the hell not? Sure, fellow students. Carloda. She has some fierce brows. Bouncy! Yum. Yay! Goodbye. <laughs> Yay, we won! Is this what involves into that eye eye? Shrewdle. It looks like it evolves into the eye eye. Am I am I wrong in thinking that? Yeah. Oh, well, goodbye. Yeah, the reason I think that is because the eyes are exactly the same. And, like, obviously, like, the one I'm talking about is a monkey Pokemon. So it's gonna have, like, a completely different, like, body shape. It has arms and stuff. But it used acid spray, and I know that the... Aye Aye is poison type. Oh, there's a TM down there. Can I just kind of... Yes, I can. Oh, oh, um, um, um. Not masquerade. Surskit! Hello, Surskit. I want a Surskit. How do I catch Pokemon that are in the water? I guess a fishing rod. Sunkern! I didn't even see them! I just ran into them! <laughs> Hello, Sunkern! The weakest Pokemon, I think, in all of Pokemon. I think it's Sunkern. Congrats. You're about to be caught. I'm gonna run out of Pokeballs by the time. And no, I won't. I have 15. I, I have a feeling I might run out of Pokeballs by the time we actually get to the school because I know I'm gonna get distracted and try and catch everything I see. I, 
I am a, um, complete the story first, the Pokedex second, other stuff third, usually. Um, it is very weak. <laughs> its only means of defense is to shake its leaves, desperately attempt to attack her. A little sun card. <laughs> and then we'll have a sun flora. Oh, I keep hitting the wrong button. I keep hitting Y when I mean to hit A. I don't know why either. Pokeball. Yeah, I'm never gonna run out of Pokeballs at the rate I keep picking them up. That's a Scatterbug. I don't care. Sorry, Scatterbug, but I don't care, but I just, I don't. Um, I won't go that way for now. Oh, hello, Scatterbug! This has been a pretty chill stream. I vibe with it. Dee 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 dee! Yay! No, I don't like covet. Um, I want to go down this little section of cliff. Alright, alright. There we go. I've got two- you've got two what, little guy? You got two Pokemon? I'll fight you and your two Pokemon with my six? I might got two whole Pokemon! Am I cool or what? Yeah, sure you are, tiny one. Oh, Azurel. So tiny and cute. It's not water type yet, though. There's one! Bring on the second one, boy. Pound hour. Ooh, yes! We're gonna switch! Um... Hmm. Actually, maybe not. I always find I'm lacking one of the starter types in early game, and right now I think it's water. Hopefully, we'll have access to catch the Pokemon that are in the lake soon. No. Ah. <laughs> I will still win. Yay! Good job. Yeah! Yeah! Yay! That went well. Ignore the, the bugs. Good. And the hop hips. Um, I'm gonna auto heal. Yay, I love that. That's just convenient AF. Why did I say AF? Pichu, 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 Pichu! Pichu! Please be a girl, Pichu. I'm picky about the genders of certain Pokemon. I don't know why. Pichu! I can't wait! I'm gonna have a Pikachu! I want a Pikachu! I want a Pikachu so bad! And if it's right and if it's not Alolan Raichu, it's gonna stay a Pikachu, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. I don't care for regular Raichu. Alolan Raichu is wonderful though. Pichu! Pikachu's not, like, my favorite Pokemon. But, as someone who's been a fan for so long, like, I cannot deny Pikachu. Despite this Pokemon's cute appearance, those who want to live with one should be prepa should prepare to be on the receiving end of its electric jolts. Yeah, because it can't control itself too well. 
And it hurts itself sometimes. Like it that's that's what happens in Smash. Alright, we'll put Igly Buff back. Okay, I want that oh, that's not what I wanted. I I want that Shrewdle Pokemon. Uh, let's try running. I haven't done that yet. Um, I don't think I have a Paralyzed Heal. Nope. Um, in that case... Sorry, I had the hiccups for a second there. Switch to Fletchling. Alright, I'm gonna catch you this time. Come on, Fletchling! Come on! Yeah. I wonder if its defense is already as low as it'll go. Catch it. Catch it. Catch it. Catch it. Yeah! <laughs> Sweet! Yeah, poison normal. Toxic mouse. I beg your pardon. That is not a mouse. To keep enemies away from its territory, it paints markings around its nest using a poisonous liquid that has an acrid odor. Yeah, I think it evolves into the eye eye. That is not a mouse, though. That is such a weird looking thing. 202. Limit X. That's a weird. That's just a weird looking Pokemon in general. Oh, Happiny! I'd love a happeny. Ooh, boy. That one's sleeping. Oh, I woke it up. Why do the scatterbugs always want to fight me? You're so tiny, my man. Chill out. Go to anger management therapy. Ah, antidote. Still not a paralyzed heal. Still not a paralyzed heal. Bonsai! Sudo, Wudo! I think that's how he sounded in the anime. Oh, right. Rock type. I don't have the right Pokemon for fighting a Bonsai. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> no, Fletchling! <laughs> oh, wow. We'll grab Gatito. Nice. Don't you throw rocks at me, too. Yay. Hans Live was caught. From its eyes, it can expel excess moisture from its body. This liquid is similar in composition to human sweat. Weird. Weird. Very strange thing to read. Um... Let's see. But I didn't want to hit boxes. I meant bag. Five... And then... Probably won't heal it again. Because we're almost... I think we're almost there. Uh, I guess I should catch a Squobit, even though I don't want one. We'll try the pig out. This is, 
This is uh, on the lower end of Pokemon for me. Squamit and Greedunt, I'm not a fan of either one of those two. Eh, it happens. Huh. Excuse me. Good job, pig. Ding! Yeehaw! Good job, piggy. No matter how much it stuffs its belly with food, it is always anxious about getting hungry again. So it stashes berries in its cheeks and tail. Annoying squirrel. Yeah, it's it's looking like oh fuck. It's looking like some it shows how many evolutions they have when you get them because it'll show the next one to two consecutive numbers. Um, and for like Ralts, it showed two, which makes sense. What is that? What is that? Oh my god, it's a whooper! Oh! Oh! I want to catch you! Little guy, please come to the edge of the water! Please? Please? Little, little mans. Little guy, please. Please! No! Whooper, please! Damn it! If, if you touch the water! If you touch the water! I want the whooper though! Whooper! I will get the whooper later then. Whatever. I want the whooper. Oh! It's an evolved scatterbug! Uh, whatever it evolves into, I can't remember the name of. I'm not gonna. I should just evolve mine. Burn heal. Nice. There are items everywhere on the ground. They're so easy to see. Um, let's keep going up then. Ooh! TM. What is it? It's another one for Swift. That's okay. Makes complete sense. Another Pokemon trainer. Um... Who I think I will skip for the moment. Oh, Pachinisu! Ah, fuck it. I missed it. That's a squirrel Pokemon I don't mind. Pachirisu's fun. I hear you! you stinking squirrel. But it looks like we're almost there. So, for now, let's... I say let's just go ahead and get to the Pokemon Center and the school, and then we can go out and catch some more. Who are you? Man with yellow text box. Yes, I'd like to heal my Pokemon. Nurse Joy looks kind of weird in this one. Thank you. Use emotes, open camera app, change outfit or look, check notices. Okay. Who are you? Hello there, I'm a Pokemon League rep. Been having some nice Pokemon battles? Well, good news. If you can defeat poor trainers here in Area 1 of the South Province, there's a lovely prize with your name on it. So far, you defeated three trainers here in Area 1 of the South Province. Once you defeat four trainers, you'll get a lovely prize. Okay. I, I don't want to. Whatever. I, I guess. Is this guy a trainer? Sure. I'll fight you with. Gakito. I'm right here, man. Oh, courier man. Okay. Rickety! Oh, Corviknight's in this game! Yeah, boy! <laughs> the 
the scatter bug. It wants to fight. The scatter bugs are so violent. Steel bird. It reminds me of that. I, I think it's Lemmy who did that. What's heavier, a kilogram of steel or a kilogram of feathers? I mean, <laughs> that's that. That's what. That's what Rickety reminds me of. Give me the prize, prize man. I think there's another one around here somewhere, but I don't care. Scatterbug just likes to watch. <laughs> I got a- Oh, I didn't even know what the prize was! I clicked A! What did I get? Battle or catch Pokemon to compile volumes in your Pokedex app with fancier covers for Pokemon you've caught. Open up your Pokedex to view all the volumes you've collected on a digital shelf and check out what rewards you can earn by pressing the X button. Yeah, LeChonk has one evolution. Taro and Chula ha seems to have one. Uh, then there's 15, 16. Hop up, skip, and the jump bluff. Fletchling, Fletchinger, Talonflame. Hami, I'm assuming, has two evolutions. Houndour and Houndoom. Young Goose and Donald Trump. Squawbit and Greedunt. Sunkern, Sunflora. Scatterbug, other Scatterbug, Vavillion, Rookity to Corvin Knight, Azurel to Zumaril, Louisel to Floatzel, Duck Duck, Golduck, Igglybuff, Jigglypuff, Wigglytuff, Routes, Curlia, Gardevoir. No, nope, Routes and Curlia! Okay. Pichu, Pikachu, Raichu, Fido has probably one evolution. Okay. And it looks like Shrewdle does too. Okay. Alright. Okay, I made it. Let me in. Like Eric Andre. Let me in! This is some nice music. Oi! Mallory! And it says I must throw my Joy-Con on accident. Did you battle some trainers on the hill? But your Pokemon are getting stronger. How about you show me how much all you been your pa battle time? Let me in! Okay. We'll just battle in front of the school gates. I got Gatito. And he, he's not paralyzed anymore. Sorry, I had to stretch something awful. Oof. So I'm coming at you with two Pokemon this time. Okay, that's fine. I have six. It's not hard! Every baby knows the starter type effectiveness setup. It's literally just rock, paper, scissors, ma'am. Uh -uh. Level 8, lol. <laughs> Pommy's electric. Okay, Fletchling, let's go. I wonder where I can get a rookie. I want a rickety. Oh wait, it's electric type! I didn't think about this. What is- is this the Terra- Terra typing thingy? <laughs> what type is it gonna be? Electric? That is... I forgot that this is a thing. Terra stylizing is always a solid strategy. It gives moves to the Pokemon's Terra type more power. Isn't there was like before you bought... If you bought the game before a certain amount of time, you got like a Pikachu with a special one? Uh, I don't remember. Shit. 
Shit. Okay. Bop. Uh. <laughs> I could use Fidel, I guess? I don't want to use Katito if I don't have to. Dog! Good job, dog! No, dog! <laughs> okay. Uh, let's just tackle it. Fuck. I should have given it swift before this. <laughs> ah, g g g g g g g we just gotta get its health down, man. Please don't die. You're gonna die. Uh... <sighs> it do be like that. Why is it a light bulb? So, um, for the terrestrializing, every Pokemon has a Terra type on top of its normal type. And when you terrestrialize it, the Terra type will show above its head, right? Um, and I guess this is based on my limited understanding, and I haven't really gotten the in game explanation yet. But, um, I'm guessing Pommy's Terra type is electric because I've seen images of the terrestrializing things. And I don't remember all of them. In fact, I really only remember flying because it's balloons, like Balloon Pikachu. Or maybe that's just Pikachu. I don't know. But yeah, because of terrestrializing and it's electric terror type. Man, I can't believe how fast you're improving. Pay me more. Give me more money, Nimona. You're the one that keeps battling me. Amazing! Look at you, taking on a terrestrialized opponent and winning no problem. Katito is great. Come to think of it, you can't terrestrialize your Pokemon yet, huh? Don't worry, I'll get you taken care of. Pokemon adding another gimmick because they're bored. Yeah, at least they're at least they're just keeping the gimmicks to like specific regions and not carrying them over and mucking them up. I think I'd rather have that. You're so good with Pokemon battles. I forget how new you are to this stuff sometimes. That's my secret. I'm not new. Those are some big ass doors. Now Mesa goes is just waiting past this gate. I got the word order wrong. At last, the city where our school is. Yay. Okay. I'm gonna walk in and see what's there. See if I can buy clothes. <laughs> nice walkway. So far this region has been very pretty. That looks like a fucking hotel. Or apartments, I guess? Alright, here I am. We finally made it, huh? This is Mesa Goza, the biggest city of Paldea. It's been a big trade hub since a long time ago. Lots of folks come here to learn about advances in technology and all kinds of other stuff. That's a box. There's a hair salon. You can change your luck. Plus places with tasty food and fixings. What do you want to see first? Hair salon. Oh, you're a fashionista, are you? Or maybe you just want a practical dude that won't get in your eyes when battling. Oh, and speaking of battling, I want to be sure you'll be able to terrestrialize your Pokemon too. There's a few things that gotta get done for that to happen, but I'll take care of them. Meanwhile, you just have fun looking around the city a bit. There's so much to do. Buy a grab a bite, buy some accessories to spice up your uniform. If you want my personal recommendation, you've gotta see Delibird presents. They sell handy items for Pokemon to hold. She is talking a lot. Once you've seen your fill, we can meet up again in the front of the school. Just be ready. The stairs up to the school are no joke. What is this, Hogwarts? 
Ugh. Later then, get pumped for some terror stylizing, I guess. Sure, why not? I'm just happy to be here. I like the, uh... I wonder if there's like an entire ass circle that has all the types. So that's fun. What is this? Oh, it's just it's like a balloon salesman. I want a balloon. I want a Pika balloon. That's not fair. All right, I am gonna take some time and just kind of look around. Bronzong. See what see what all sites there are to see. See how big this place is. See if I can find any items sitting around. You know, the normal things you do. Yep, there's one. Super potion! Yay. Let's go this way. Greedunt. That looks like a cafe. I'll go in. Oh. Oh! Okay. Boo! I thought it was like a cafe where you could go in and battle people. Like the ones in Sword and Shield. Uniforms are so cool. No, child, they are not. Is this another food place? Food place, okay. Oh, this looks like a store. Oh, that's Deli Bird Presents. Um, oh, Rotom Phone Cases. I am such a child. Gatito Case, Fuecoco, Quaxly, Yellow, Green, Purple, Pink, Blue, Turquoise, Olive, Rose, Brown, and Lavender. Lavender! Yes, please. Uh, I guess from this section, yeah. Uh, general goods. Uniforms can be cool, just not this one. See, I disagree. I don't think uniforms are cool at all. Everyone's different, but I don't think they're cool. So Ooh, you can get Soothe Bells. I'll have to come back. Miracle Seeds. Oh, Held Items! Sweet! Okay. That's- this is a good place to think- to know of. Pokeballs and heal balls. I don't need any right now. Okay. Okay. Good to know. Oh, sandwich man! Olaf, for fresh produce, look no further than Delicioso! <laughs> good name! Good name! Oh, these are ingredients for, uh, cooking- uh... Sandwiches! I'll buy three of each. Buen provecho. Mmm, chorizo. I haven't had chorizo in so long. I used to live in a place that had a lot of, like, authentic Mexican places. Like, there were tons of Mexican places within a very short distance. And now it's, uh, it's completely different. I have a lot of, like, all different types of food from all over Asia are really uh, easy for me to access, but finding like authentic Mexican is a little bit of a pain. Oh, hey, okay. A sandwich pick with a simple blue Pokeball design. Picks. This is fun. A very salty seasoning! You mean... salt? Okay, I'm going to spend all my money on sandwich ingredients if I do not continue on. <laughs> a quick claw? What about a quick claw? Okay. What else would it be, right? There's another Deli Bird presence! Do you have different one? Do you have different things? Do you have different things? Probably not. Yeah. Yeah, that's it for me. 
Anything else we can offer you? Uh, what do you have under general goods? Yeah, okay, it's the same stuff. Okay. Thank you. Random NPC shopkeep. Do you have anything behind your store? No. <laughs> you know where my priorities like Colby! Oh, I can't talk to you. Hello! I like your combi. Can't be in. Uniforms are not cool. Oh, this looks fancy. Uh, what do you have? This is like going a block away from one McDonald's only to find another McDonald's. It really is. Fruit. I'm spending all my money on sandwich ingredients. <laughs> nope. I can't wait. Look, when I get to actually start making the sandwiches, I'm very, I'm very excited for that. <laughs> oh, another place. Another delicioso. Oh, they have the same stuff. Stop crouching, you dummy! This is a dead end, is it? Egg power? Pokemon eggs when you're out on a picnic. Okay, that's what that means. That's another restaurant. That looks like another food place. Lots of, lots and lots of food places. Do what's down here? Doesn't look like anything is down here. Oh, it looks like it's just a path. Well, that's it. Well, what's it? What's up? Oh, he's lost. Another restaurant, it looks like. This one also looks like a restaurant. Yep. Seafood place. They really have, like, real fucking stuff. Like, arroz con leche and ceviche. I did ceviche in a long time either. Uh, what is it with video games constantly making me hungry? Yakuza was really bad about it. And I wasn't expecting Pokemon to be bad about it, but no. Here we are. That's another cafe. Where the frick is- I wanted to find the hair salon. Where is it? Oh, I guess- Oh, it's over that way. Okay. Wee. Video games got the tasty food. Yeah, I know. I was explaining to somebody, um, because they were asking me- Or, they weren't asking me. We were talking- we were just talking about anime. Um, and I was telling him, you know why anime food looks the way it does? And he was like, no? And I was like, the, it's the anime cabbage incident. He's like, no, what the fuck are you talking about? And it's some harem anime. I don't remember what it's, what it was. I have no clue. But, um, it had a cooking episode. And it was, they had a, just a green ball for cabbage. Just a genuine, okay, that's a food space. I have had a quesadilla recently. <laughs> um, and it was just a green ball. And then when she cut it, it just was still a green ball with like green lines in it. Like how Hadri has rings. And that was such a like controversy. That since then, like all anime has had always had like a focus on drawing the food correctly. This is not a store I can enter. Why make the why make it look like I can enter? This looks like I can enter. Oh, it looks like a pharmacy. Oh yeah, okay. No thanks, I'm good. Okay. What's this? No, 
that's just a storefront. Starly! It's a pretty simple Pokemon to throw in. There are three big cities here in Paldea. Only three? That seems smallish. But, you know, what do I know? Hmm. Okay. Slow blue! Okay, here are the clothing stores. I found them! <laughs> Zapaldea footwear. Okay. Oh, everything's gonna be really expensive! <laughs> I'm probably not going to have the money to buy anything right now. That's okay. Okay, I know what the performance sneakers look like. Earthworm. Drowsing. Like, drowsy? Oh no, it's the koala Pokemon, whose name I can't remember. Fancy sneakers. Ooh, those are fun. Low tops. Very boring. Oh, but they got pastel colors! They got pastel colors! Oh! Pastels! I love me some pastels, baby! Yeah, I, I don't have the money. <laughs> but at least I found stuff. It's a different store for everything! I think I found it. That cabbage is so sad. Yeah, it's just like a- it's literally just like a circular green ball. And it was so bad that they had to edit it for like the uh, home video release. So if you- or was it the English dub? One of those. But um, there are edits to where it looks a lot more like natural. So funny. Sporty high socks. I can change my socks. I think socks are, are, are affordable. I don't know. Oh, the plaids are ugly. The florals are also a little ugly. Not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, it's something. Are there purple? Because the purple would go well with- Ah, uh, yes. Purple would go well with the uniform. Yeah. Glasses. Let me. <laughs> it didn't register. But I stepped there. That's funny. That's so funny. Uh, I can't tell with white. Half rims look nice. I have to wear glasses sometimes. Oh, uh, those are nice. And I don't want stun glasses, I don't think. But yeah, let's go ahead and do glasses. That's different. That'll be fun. Yay! Yes, I'll wear them. Yes. Uh, yeah, I like the glasses. That looks cute. This one's got a sign on the door. Oh! Oh, hats! Excellent. Oh, I already have a white sporty cap. Okay, it's just a traditional baseball. Yeah, it doesn't look like a flat brim to me. Sporty cap for typings. Oh, that's normal. That's boring. Electric. Where's Fairy? Alola, once again, I am looking at hats. The sport ones don't look super great, yeah. It's... Eh, the ghost one looks okay, I think. Yeah, that one doesn't. That one doesn't. Oh, come on. I want to see what dark looks like. Oh, that's boring. So far, the only good hat is the... Oh, no! It's a Gatsby hat! It's a Gatsby hat! <laughs> Sorry. The name. The name just... It's a Gatsby hat. It's the great Gatsby. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
sorry. <laughs> this is so funny to me. Okay. I like the beanie the most, but it still sits weird on the character's head. So, I'm gonna leave, and I'm going to hope eventually I can just take the hat off somewhere. That's what the goal is gonna be. <laughs> What's over here? I'm just in the town looking at all of the shops. Oh, hair salon! Hey, I found it. Buenas, muchacha! Oh, hello. Oh! Toksan! Thank you! I have got to change that notification. Okay, it's all the same hairstyles. There's nothing new. Boo. Okay, I don't care then. I just want to take the hat off. Change it to a foghorn. <laughs> Gotta think about that. I, I don't- I'm not super happy with any of my, um, alert sounds. They're just kind of what I cobbled together. That's the thing I'm trying to think of. <laughs> oh, that's not a weird shaped backpack. And that's only one. Okay. I like the little leather bag it gave me better. Yeah, that's a much better bag. Okay, I've looked at the stores. They were disappointing. I am going forward. They probably have the best fashion stores for last. Like at the last major city. Why is it so circular? I do not know the answer to that question. Oh, this is that character everybody was like losing their mind over. I want the Eevee backpack! I want Oh, Team Star is just, like, a thing. Right. Seriously, what's with you? Don't you want to burn bite with awesome friends like us? Not really. We've got a quota we're supposed to fill for new members. What is wrong with y'all? No. Another ignorant little nobody. Here I'm finally part of Team Star and I still get no respect. Look, did you see that temper tantrum animation? <laughs> hey, we can't just let something like this slide. The honor of our team's on the line, so we've got no real choice but to battle, yeah? It's the Fire Emblem Engage MC. Oh, yeah. That joke. Oh, hey, Car Mangler! It's, um, it's laggy, but other than that, it's been pretty good. I'll make sure this fresh face nobody ends up seeing stars. Okay, I was like, are they running away or are they running for a Pokemon battle? I was That's silly. That's silly. The little hand movement is so silly. You're on the fence if you want it or not. That's valid. But I mean, we all knew I was gonna get it day one. <laughs> if nothing else, you can use me as a reference <laughs> for the game. What the? Ugh. I hate this thing. Fucking Shrudel. So far the worst of the new Pokemon. Deep. Goodbye. Get out of here. We don't want you here. Yay! The little word weaver learned assurance. I don't even remember what assurance does. I, why are you seeing stars? Nothing happened to you physically. You're just standing there. I'm not even reading these grunt lines. I just, I just don't care. Pero bueno, what do you think you're doing? It's that student council dweeb. She's going to report us if we don't book it. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Who was it? Was it Tuttle that said that 
that they had a bad feeling about Nimona. Is it, it, this is like starting to get more Yandere vibes as time goes on. <laughs> you don't have to go find randos to battle. You'll have all the battles you ever need with me. That was you, Toxon? Okay, I couldn't remember. I was like, it was, it was you or Tuttle. Wait, they picked the fight with you? Wow, I read that way wrong. Sorry. I get it now. You two have got Team Star written all over you, for sure. I bet you were trying to pressure people into signing up again, weren't you? Ah, uh, hi. We weren't... Not doing that. Well, that explains it. As head of the student council, stopping this type of nonsense would normally be my job. But this is also the perfect chance for you to try out my amazing and ultra-rare gift to you. Is it terrestrializing stuff? Terra Orb. Okay. Yay! Scarlet Violet gimmick. <laughs> Grass type Terra. Yeah, but the Terra types can be different than the Pokemon's normal type. So I was really hoping it would be something different. That'd be fun. Wait, what? You want the kids practice wailing on us with their Terra Pokemon? Is that it? Got a problem? Want to battle me instead? Never mind, I'll take my chances with the new kid. And she's making us battle now. Oh, so like Delta types? Ex I think, yeah. I think Terra types are uh, kind of work how Delta types do. Which, I was not expecting someone to bring up Delta types. <laughs> I, haven't, <laughs> I haven't thought about Delta types in so long. I don't have a ton of Delta type cards. I've got a couple. It changes type changes to Terra type. You won't be able to Terra a Pokemon again until you heal up at a Pokemon Center. Okay. <laughs> Look, I'm also an old woman when it comes to Pokemon. I get it. Yay, Terra stylizing. We're doing the thingy, Mabob. Bing. He got a sun flower! Oh! So cute! The cat's so fucking cute, I can't! Oh. I wonder if US Pokemon Center has the life-size plushies yet. I really want the life-size Frigatito one. <laughs> It'll go great with my life-size Pop Leo! <laughs> Rip Young Goose! Bye, Young Goose! Did that say ask for advice? Hang on. I next time that pops up, I've got to see what that does. She's still cheering. <laughs> Why does she have heels and a helmet? The the team is goofier than Team Yell was. Nice! You pulled off terrestrializing? No problem. Moves of your Pokemon's Terra type will hit even harder when it's terrestrialized, you know? Sometimes you'll find a Pokemon whose Terra type is totally different from its usual type. That difference can open up your strate strategic options. Blech. Why not change your Terra or a Pokemon Center after every use by healing up your team, though? My secret hope is that this game addresses the war from X and Y. I didn't finish X and Y. <laughs> Hasta la vista! Instead of hasta la vista, it's hasta la vista. So, yeah. Team Star is basically a group of students that like to kick up trouble. They hardly ever show up to class, and when they get together in groups, they're a real headache. Even the teachers don't know what to do with them, from what I hear. Um, excuse me. I, uh, I just... Oh, thanks. Okay. So, yeah. See you around. I want your backpack! I need the lore! I don't trust Pokemon for lore. You know. Already becoming a big hero around campus. I don't think I've seen that girl around. Maybe she's a new transfer like you. That Eevee bag, though. Love that fluff! Anyway, seems like the trouble's died down, so we'd better book it up to school. 
Get ready to climb the worst staircase in the world. Okay. Will it time me? All right, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven seconds. That was nothing. Famous Academy Staircase. That was nothing. You guys are weaklings. Weaklings! Duck! 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 <laughs> oh! Um, uh, Rock Roth! I was about to say Lycan Rock. No, it's not Lycan Rock. Alright, let's just go inside and get this over with. Is that- oh no, that's also a rock rough. I was like, is that an Esper?! And I was about to get excited. It helps that your walk animation skips half the steps. Of course it does! Yay, we made it! Here we are, welcome to Uva Academy. This here is the entrance hall. You can sign up for all kinds of classes, and those halls off to the sides leads to different parts of the school. Blah 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 I was not going to continue with that. <laughs> I was I was about to be a home star reference that made no contextual sense. Miss Mallory, Miss Nimona, how did you find your first school commute? Yay. I imagine Miss Nimona's high spirits helped with that. She's a true asset to our fine academy. Not that I was expecting any less from our champion ranked student council president. I think I've only seen a few games have specific stairwalking animations. I can't even think of one. Well, I know how to look after my friends. Most of the time you justify physics. Yeah. They're better about, like, ladders in video games. Oh, but speaking of which, we saw some of those Team Star kids in town, Director. You did? Where? I was down the stairs from the front gates. They were hassling this kid with an Eevee backpack. That is quite the news. Are they still to be found out there? Actually, Mallory flexed on them and ran them off. I don't say. Of course, it's a fine thing to try to help a fellow student, Miss Mallory, but you might wish to show a bit of restraint as you find your feet here at our academy. And Miss Nimona, do remember that the school staff is here to resolve any such troubles. Uh, right. Yes, sir, director. A child with an Eevee backpack, you say? I suppose that might have been Miss Penny. I'm relieved to hear she's come to class, at least. Uh, and Miss Nimona, if you'd be so good, do report to Mr. Jock about this Team Star business. As your homeroom teacher, he should be kept apprised of all such goings-on. You got it, sir! Ah, oh, but look at the time. You two had better hurry along. Classes will be starting soon. We're in class 1A. And I remember school. Grapes. Oh, I wonder if the orange... I wonder if it's oranges if you picked scarlet. Look at the... Oh, no, this is lag! This is lag! This is the laggiest bit so far, baby! <laughs> Look at them! <laughs> Look at them! <laughs> sitting next to Nimona. Oh my god, look at his hair! Look at his glasses! Look at his entire outfit! Oh. <laughs> look at... Look at... <laughs> he looks so funny. Oh, we have a new student. We have a new little friend joining our happy homeroom. I hate the way he's talking. <laughs> okay, you can come on in. That's me. I never had to switch schools, so I don't know if, like, we have a new student. Please welcome XYZ. Is a real thing that happens? Did 
Did you hear that? She seems super friendly and fun. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, I guess it's the boy with brown hair who's not the one kicking his legs and severely lagging. Yeah, that's pretty much how it goes. Yeah. I did not switch schools once. I went to the same school. What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? I like to play with them. They're fun. I bet you would have said that no matter what I said. Does anyone else have a question for their new classmate? It's Nimona. You went to all the trouble of enrolling here, so spill. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? I don't actually know. I don't know why I'm here. The possibilities are endless. He wears sandals! He wears sandals! That man! He teaches bio? I would have I would have pinned him as the chemistry teacher, I'm not gonna lie. Second row from the front. Okay. Take in a seat. Alright, you ragamuffins. <laughs> Be nice and friendly. We will, Mr. Jack. Please don't make me do class. Get to know the campus by exploring a bit on your own. A biology class, a math class, and a battle class. She got called to the staff room. Welcome. Thanks for answering my question earlier. You're welcome. What? You want to talk to me? Oh, shy. Yo, new kid. These guys all have nothing to say. Fun. You can now move around the school. Try checking out places on the map where you see that someone might be hanging around. Perhaps you'll be discovering of something. I should not read multiple sections of text at once. The kind ladies working in the cafeteria make delicious food every day. A room for the faculty? Why would I go to the faculty? Grapes. Yeah, I wonder if in Scarlet it's oranges. Everybody's eating. Zora! Look at the Zora! It's so cute. I heard that in other regions, people like to eat rice covered in the stuff called curry. Have you ever had curry before? Yes, it's so delicious. I would love some. My favorite curry place closed down because of COVID, and I'm still mad. I've been mad since COVID started and they closed down. I'm so mad. They literally had the best curry I've ever eaten in my life. And I'm not over it yet. Oh, hey, so we meet again. You remember me, right? Oh, from the lighthouse. That's my little know-it-all, buddy. It's so tragic. It's... And I've been going to different curry places around town and no one is as good. Nobody. It makes me so depressed. <laughs> no need to tell me your name. Valerie, right? Excuse me, I'm yawning. The whole school seems to be talking about you. Why? The new kid who showed up with the president of the student council. Oh. I normally wouldn't even bother showing up for class, but I came all the way to school today just to talk with you, our new celebrity. You seem really angry. You gotta help me out so I can finally make my dream a reality. Also, can we talk about how this is supposed to be a cafeteria, but it just looks like a banquet room at a convention center? Happy to help. What kind of little maniac says yes to something without even knowing what they're agreeing to? This little maniac. Well, this might come as a surprise, but fact is, I'm all about that picnic life. The great outdoors, the perfectly prepared sandwiches. This is like my college- Really? Your college cafeteria is like this? Mine was like a real, real true blue cafeteria. Like... Mine looked more like a traditional American high school cafeteria than this by a long, long, long shot. Just missing the Texas shaped waffle. Oh my god, the waffle makers! I did not have a Texas shaped waffle maker because I'm not from Texas. But we had waffle. We, there were fist fights over the waffle makers at my college. Right now, I'm researching new recipes that'll help Pokemon feel better. Real health food, see? I found this book the other day, and it had a section about these Herba Mystica things. 
Basically, there's some kind of special herbs that heal up any Pokemon as soon as it eats them. Now, there are a total of five different types of Urban Mystica based on what I've read. Just taking a little lick of them once they've been powdered will get your blood flowing. My nutrients prevent aging. It'll even boost the immune system. These herbs seem like they're the real deal. Real deal. Yeah. Only found here in Paldea. And rare to boot. But this book says they're all guarded by Titan Pokemon? I mean, that's going to be pretty tough to try to grab even a few sprigs. Because, see, Titans are... Well, I think they've got to be things like this. Don't. Oh, 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 the Dawn fan. Nothing of its treads of iron. That's the future one. I think. I think. I thought they were just variants, but I'm not sure. I really want to get those herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. Don't have any friends with strong Pokemon to lend me a hand either. And I'd never hear the end of it if I went crawling to that stupid council hall. But here you, Waltz up! You've got to help me out with this. You'd be perfect. I don't know. I've only seen like the tiny bits and glimpses that the marketing showed of the different Dawn fan forms. I'm just taking an educated guess. I would assume they'd be like different forms of Dawn Van similar to like different regional forms, but uh, uh, your guess is as good as mine. Nope, wait, I don't need an answer yet. I'll just register the places where it seems there might be Titans in your map app for you. Oh, look at his! This is pretty. False. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Quaking Earth, False Dragon, Open Sky, Lurking Steel, Stony Cliff. So we're at one big city, and there are four lighthouses. Okay. Okay. I guess that's one of the main bits that we're gonna do. Let it stew a bit, and we can get more into the details later. In the meantime, take this. A little gift for listening at all. Stardust! Free money! Give the idea some serious thought, please! As he runs away. Yeah, this is definitely different from my college cafeteria. Like, it's not like... This is different. Oof. The little children. Maybe that'll help my grades. Yo, buying food. Oh, sandwiches. Peanut butter sandwich, pickle sandwich, potato salad, egg. I would get a peanut butter sandwich. Peanut butter sounds really good right now. Wrote a moment! Hello. This is Mallory, correct? I hacked your smartphone so I could talk to you! Hope you don't mind! I'm sorry, who are you? Cassiopeia! That's not a real name. But never mind that. It's you I want to talk about. I hear you're a trainer with serious potential. I look pissed. If that description is accurate, there's something I'd like to ask of you. Tell me. You know about Team Star, right? Yeah. Great. I appreciate you being up front here. Team Star is a group of troublemakers formed by some academy students a while back. They can cause headaches for the school and try to bring the other students down to their level. And I refuse to sit idly by and let them get away with it. So I've come up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. I call it Operation Starfall. But I'll need allies to carry out this operation, and I'd like you to be one of them. Um, sure, why not? Whatever. I, I, I'm I, saying yes to anybody. No need to reply right this second. We can discuss the details some other time. Till then, I'll leave you to it. Bye. Okay! How does anyone know that you're so great yet? You literally just got here. That's my question! Please do try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? You don't want anyone else overhearing any personal information, after all. 
Honestly, there are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. Okay? Okay. Something feels sus. Name star, you say. Something feels really sus. Woo! Okay. <laughs> I feel like he might be a bad guy with that little bit. <laughs> but it is almost three o'clock. Um, like I said, I was going to stop at three because I have stuff I have to do tonight and I need time. Um, so I am going to call it there, which is fun. Um, I'd also thought about maybe trying to raid somebody for the first time, which I've never done. Um, or maybe not. I don't know. At some point I'm going to, but I don't know if today's that day. Anyway, <laughs> sorry, I'm just like rambling and like I have all these thoughts and now I'm, my mind's switching to like, oh, I have shit I have to do mode. We love brains, right? He's going to commit tax fraud. Oh, no. <laughs> He's going to commit tax fraud. Oh, no. <laughs> Let me turn it down over here. Okay. Thank you so much for coming to the stream. Sonomicon is still going? Okay. Um, I am going to continue to work on that while talking, but um, <laughs> thank you guys so much for um, coming to my stream today. I will be back tomorrow at the exact same time to play more Pokemon. Um, I might play a little bit in between now and tomorrow just to like get some grinding out of the way, but I'm probably not gonna go too far. I will definitely be back with more Pokemon tomorrow and then Sunday I'll be on Puck Sun stream. Um, yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for coming, even if it's just for a few minutes. I always appreciate anytime anybody comes and visits and like shares the day with me or whatever and just just being in the thoughts <laughs> that's all the, yeah everything's great everything's wonderful everything's fabulous <laughs> i will um see you guys 